this. Uh, going in. Here we go. For victory! Oh, 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 oh! I can't unsee those skulls now. Ugh. It sees me, it sees me, it sees me! Don't you can't get me over the rock. You can't get me over the rocks. I hate horror games. I hate this. Welcome back to Luke Lawson Plays. Today we are diving back into Kolot. And the Russian wilderness is a cold and foreboding place. Especially when someone takes the time to carve skulls on the side of a mountain. I don't understand. But we're gonna we're gonna press on. We're gonna grab the page and Maybe learn something new. We are sitting in room number 23. Although sitting might not be the right word because we are running around trying to finish up packing anything else we could need. Uh, food cans, tools, essentially whatever we get our hands on. We want to be sure that we took everything we could possibly need. We're running out of time. Damn it, where did I put my belt? I'm sure we forgot about something. We're almost ready. We lost the knife. We're counting the money. We're leaving the room in a complete mess. So, we made it to the train station. We're singing all the songs we know and making up new ones as well. Everyone is so excited. Finally, at around 3 a.m., we go to bed. I wonder, what is awaiting us when we get there? What will we see? How far will we make it? I hear the rest of the group breathing peacefully and it's snowing outside. Okay, so that must be an entry from one of the skiers that was on the ski team prior to leaving on their trip. I am nervous, but we made it to the Super Skull, and I feel like there's another page nearby. What is that sound? Ugh. Creepy game is creepy, and I want to know what's inside that glowing mountain. I want to know what's going on with the red light. Maybe the red light's just an orientation point, but I still feel like it's the Eye of Sauron watching us and sending evil things across our path at all times. I don't want to fall. I don't want to fall. How am I supposed to get over there? For the record, there is no jump button that I've discovered yet. Oh god. Almost went all the way down. Can I go... Uh, uh, uh. Uh, where is... Where is I? Okay, so the Super Skulls seem to be... Right about here. We went way out of our zone. That's where I want to go. I don't know if you guys realize this. This is where I've been trying to go is right here. And I've missed it. I've missed the mark so severely, in fact, that there should have been a campsite at one of those previous places. If I just run and jump, can I make it? There's no jump button. So I'm just gonna run for it. Here we go. For victory! Oh, 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 oh! I, I didn't make it. Okay, so we're back. We've respawned. There's some supplies up on top of that, but I don't think I can actually get to them. Or do I have to come from a different angle to get to them? I don't entirely know. I feel like I can maybe make that jump if I run at the correct angle. Because it's not a jump, but I think I can fall onto that cliff, if that makes any sense. Could just be me. Wishful thinking. We're gonna try it one more time. Look at that. It's all about the angle. All about the ankle. 
Soviet Research Unit for Natural Phenomenon, or the S R U N P SNRP, regarding the occurrence of anomaly OH-91. First incidents took place in 1950 and 1953 in the area of Ergarka by the construction of the Transpolar Main Line. The works were halted and the incidents classified. Any witnesses were ordered to be eliminated. So anyone that saw what happened was murdered. Cool. That's a good way to keep things under wraps. On October 17, 1950, according to witness evidence, at the same altitude as Camp 503 to the west of Agarica City, an emanation of unknown force and source occurred and caused instant death of 42 workers. The bodies literally evaporated and only shadows were left as the witnesses testified. The incident was sudden and short. <sighs> the next incident took place three years later on March 14, 1953. Then, also in the above mentioned camp, a solidification effect occurred. The bodies of 12 workers just froze. After autopsy, they were declared dead. Oh. That does, after autopsy, they were declared dead. Okay. The bodies are still lying intact in Section 12 of the Seversk Research Complex. So, something happened that caused people to burst into nothingness and become shadows. And then another incident occurred that caused people to freeze solid instantly. And... They were unexplained phenomenon that also happened to be taking place where we are currently. I don't think I can go back up there. No. The answer is I cannot go back up there. What a creepy trail. I can't unsee those skulls now. Ugh. Um, I think we can traverse this trail and make our way to the bottom slowly. Nope. Ugh. No, I can't make it down there at any speed. Alright, we are back on top of the precipice. Yeah, I can't jump up. That's going to be my problem. Going up is going to be the bigger problem here. Can I make it? Nope, I'm going to fall straight into the abyss if I go that way. If I cross over, I might be able to make that jump without dying? It's worth a shot. Yes, the snow has broken our fall, and we live to tell the tale of our adventure. Okay, well, ever onward, we shall trudge through the snow we wander, and there is no one to judge. I don't like when it gets quiet. Gosh, I don't like when it gets quiet. We haven't seen the creepy thing in a while. I'm not complaining. I just find that odd. I can only assume that means I'm doing something wrong. Because if we were doing something correctly he would be angry and trying to kill us as long as we wander aimlessly I think we'll be safe we just gotta stay out of his way it is not my intention to anger that beast again I'm definitely going kinda crazy out here though but isn't a real trail. I mean, it is, but it's a it's a road to nowhere. I think this is a frozen river I'm walking on. 
Oh, I hear creepy music. I don't have any interest. Does that mean he's behind me? Or in front of me? Another bridge. A totem. We're on the right path to something. Ugh, I get lightheaded. Under this bridge area down. Nope. Not actually. This is our only way. Oh my gosh, I get so freaked out. Freaked out. So there should be another campfire at some point. I feel like I probably past it? Why? 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 There it is. So that's where we need to make it to. Oh my gosh. Or maybe that one. Ominous music. I keep thinking it's gonna be right behind me. You guys are no. uh, at the beginning I wanted to make things right. I believed God itself touched me. That I have received a chance, a compensation for the evil that was brought upon me. That I understood. That it is not God, or good, or restitution. Just a tool of revenge. This seems welcoming. Pull up your britches. We're going inside a mountain pass. With a boatload of skulls on sticks. Very, very welcoming. I like what you've done with the place. It's the opposite of not creepy right now. I'm, I apologize for being so quiet. I'm just nervous. I... Am I coming to you? Yes, Sean Bean. I need you to guide me through this. Really? I'm gonna slide off. No. Ugh. This is currently semi reminiscent of Horizon Zero Dawn as I'm just exploring in the snow. Except for I had a weapon. What did I do? What did I do wrong? Where do I just jump off? Was I supposed to go up a different path? Should I have turned the other way? Did I miss another trail? There's definitely a fire in here. the game won't let me get to. Is 
Was I supposed to go up that other way instead of across? Can I go up the other way? Sorry about your bad news, bro. You did not make it. I feel like maybe I have to go that way. But going down will never take you up. Ah! No! And once I go down, I'm then stuck in that location. Oh! that. This isn't another skull mountain, is it? I mean, seriously, once once I make that jump, I'm physically incapable of returning. Well, I'm committed. Committed to what? I don't know yet, but I'm definitely committed. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm gonna run. I think I just survived an avalanche. You're a squatty little totem creature. Why not go into the mountain? Seems like a valid thing to do. Uh, is that another page? Oh my god. It's right there. It's right there. It's right there. Does it see me? Oh my gosh. It sees me, it sees me, it sees me! Don't, you can't get me over the rock, you can't get me over the rocks! No, you can't, you can't, you can't, you can't! Um, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.